Now, hello people, how y'all doing in this moment of time? Just wanna come on here for a quick message at this moment. But um, before we get off of today, let's get off to a prayer. Thank you, Father God, for waking us up this morning, blessing us, see you in the day. Watch your words to God as God is protect us throughout this day, lead us throughout this day, Father God, show us the way. And I pray, Father God, you come to me at this moment in time, Lord, to give people out to the truth. And I pray, Father God, you let the Holy Spirit come to me at this moment in time. In order to give the people some too. And I thank you for this in my prayer for that. Amen. Man. I just don't know. Messing with people with these devices and everything. You understand? This this device I told you that was up in the uh, up in the air. With these stars, it looks like stars, but it's not the stars. Um, there's a couple of them up in, in the air um, that is like a couple, they turn colors, okay? And then you got a couple of them that is very bright. They look like stars, they're not stars. Even the ones that's turning colors, they're not stars. It is a perimeter that is set around the earth that these enemies put around the earth to keep people from ascending out and up. Out of the earth. And out of this world. But what you don't know is, is to try to keep other things, keep other things out too. I'm gonna tell you something. Let me show you something right quick. You go to my um. Now I just made a video. About this Marcus Rogers, right? Let me show you how the enemy show. Let me show you how the enemy tells on itself. <clears throat> I made the, the uh, excuse me. <laughs> I made the um, this video about uh, Marcus Rogers, right? Let me tell you how the enemy tells on itself. Right. Okay. Well, anyways. <laughs> I said it, but anyways, uh, what happened was they just copyrighted the claim. I mean, they copyrighted the claim of that video. If it wasn't true, why would you copyright claim? It's not rocket science. If it wasn't true, why would you copyright claim? Out of all the videos now, all my other videos have been going through for a couple of days now. If this video wasn't true, then why would you copyright claim it? I should have sent it again, but you'll be able to see it. Just look on the video. You'll be able to look at it. But what I want y'all to know is that yes, it is true. The things that I speak of about him and about what's going on, it's true. Like I said, if it wasn't true, why would they copyright claim it? That's because it's true. You see, this, um, I came on here for another thing to take, talk to y'all and give y'all, okay? But I also wanted to let y'all know that these are the ways that these enemies tell on themselves and that they do things to uh, make you, uh, try and make you look foolish. Now, I don't know what they're going to do with the video or however they do with it or whatever they do with it. It does not matter. Because now it's out. So they can do what they want to do to try and edit it to make it say certain. I don't care. I don't care. But you can go on my video and on my um, uh, uh, videos here and you can look at it and see the real editing. So whatever they trying to do to edit with that copyright claim and send whatever they send it to, you can look on my videos and look at the real video. Whenever they get through, <laughs> you can look at my video and go on the videos and look at it and see whatever else I said, all right? So what this video is about is uh, what I want to speak to y'all about is uh, 
whatever you're going through at this moment in time, this is what I want you to say. So that you can get this enemy up off of you. And that what you don't know about this world, about this planet. Let me show you something. What I want you to say to this enemy that's in your ear, that's in your kasha record, that's in your ear, instead of speaking in your ear. And you say this. When you say this, it's going to drown him out. Like he's going to either flee or one of the two, he's going to flee. You say, get out of my ear, you computer Satan. He's going to flee. Because this is what I want you to know. These spirits and these demons that's roaming around here, they're computerized. Yeah. So say, get out of my ear, computer, and see what happens. I just want you to test the theory. Test the theory and see what happens. Just whatever is attacking you, just say, get up out of my, my ear, you, you computer. Get up out of my ear. You know, or, or, or come off of me, computer, and watch and see what happens. See, this is the state of being in a higher conscious mind when you know that you've lifted out of this planet. You understand? This is why you know the real truth of this planet, of this simulation. You understand? So once you start, once you say that, it's either going to flee or you're going to see it's going to break down. Like the thing, because he knows that you're telling the truth. When you tell the truth on these things, these things have to break. I don't care what it does, you exposing it. When you expose it, it has to break. It has to go. Because <laughs> you exposed him. So now that you exposed him, it has to leave you. You get what I'm saying? So, all right. Now, break him down. When you do that, get him out of here. Alright? That's how you do that. So, I pray that y'all take these messages to the Lord Jesus Christ at this moment in time. Get to some fast and praying, so reading the word, build a relationship with the Lord, commune with the Lord, and uh, this is God's good news for you today. Y'all be blessed. Amen.